Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. In January 2024, France revealed its strategy to reinforce Ukraine's defense capabilities by pledging to supply several hundred ASM, armament air sol modulaire, air ground modular armament, hammer precision guided munitions, with an ongoing delivery plan of 50 units per month throughout the year. By March 12, 2024, French Defense Minister, Sébastien Lecornu, elaborated that approximately 600 ASM bombs would be provided to Ukraine within 2024. The first documented use of the ASM in Ukraine occurred on March 5, 2024, marking a notable milestone in the operational deployment of these advanced munitions during the ongoing conflict. This delivery and subsequent utilization of the ASM bombs are part of France's broader assistance to Ukraine, aimed at bolstering its military capabilities against opposing forces. The development of the ASM bomb commenced in the late 1990s, with the French DGA, Direction Générale d'Alarmement, placing the first order in 2000. Although experiencing a two-year delay in development, it eventually entered into service and commenced deliveries in 2007. The ASM made its combat debut in 2008 during the war in Afghanistan, where it supported ground troops from a Rafale fighter. The French ASM, Armament Air Sol Modulaire, also referred to as Hammer, Highly Agile Modular Munition Extended Range, is an advanced air-to-ground weapon crafted by Safran Electronics and Defense. France has supplied several hundred ASM-guided bombs to Ukraine as part of military aid, which encompasses scalp EG missiles and ASM bombs. Noteworthy for its precision and adaptability, the ASM system can support various mission types and bomb sizes, including 125, 250, 500, and 1000 kg versions. The ASM's design integrates a guidance kit and propulsion system, enabling it to engage targets with remarkable precision over long distances. Its guidance system merges GPS, inertial navigation, and in certain versions, laser or infrared homing, to achieve high accuracy. Incorporating a rocket booster and enlarged fins in the range extension kit empowers the munition to engage targets from substantial distances, augmenting its operational versatility. The ASM program's cost, covering development and delivery of 2,348 kits, is estimated at 846 million euros, with a per weapon cost of approximately $300,000. This cost surpasses that of comparable American JDAM kits, primarily due to lower production volumes. However, potential economies of scale could mitigate the cost of the French munition through larger contracts. Operational deployment of the ASM has showcased its efficacy in diverse combat scenarios, including Afghanistan and Libya, where it was employed by French Rafale fighters. Its capability to be launched from off-axis angles and its precision-guided features have been particularly lauded in these conflicts. Now, with Ukraine joining its list of operators, the ASM's role in contemporary air-to-ground warfare continues to evolve. France's decision to supply ASM bombs to Ukraine aligns with its broader commitment to aid the country amidst the conflict. Providing these advanced munitions aims to enhance Ukraine's long-range strike capabilities and operational effectiveness in complex combat environments. That's all for now. See you later.